What is going on, man? We are back with uh, redoing week one here. Um, this week went really, really well. Uh, I have no complaints. It was kind of crazy. I was still sore on Monday. Um, obviously, not as sore as I was uh, the prior week, but I was like still, my quads and stuff were still storm that following Monday. So, yeah, that, that first Monday back wrecked me pretty good, but uh, we're feeling good now. Um, didn't really have any complications this week. Um, I did kind of want to touch on how everything felt. Um, like, I, I'd say overall, my body feels like okay. Uh, it definitely doesn't feel great, but uh, it feels fine. Um, my shoulder bugged me here and there throughout the week, but I never had to uh, reduce weight or do anything that I didn't want to do. Um, it just kind of bugged me here and there. Uh, my glute was okay. Um, it's kind of frustrating because it's still there. It's still an annoyance. Um, it's not so much pain, though. It's more just like a sensation, almost just like it's... It's just tight, you know, that my, my left piriformis is just tight. That's the best way I can describe it. I th between almost every deadlift set, I basically just had to stretch it out for 20 to 30 seconds, which isn't that big of a deal, um, and I'll take that over, like, the real bad pain that it was in when I actually injured it. So, I don't know, man. I mean, it had been almost a month since I deadlifted, um, so I guess this is just going to be something that we have to kind of watch and deal with. Um, I'll let you know if it starts, like, actual pain starts happening, but... Yeah, I mean, like I was having some left erector pain, um, and then I started like, so basically when I got injured, I couldn't contract it, and so I kind of stopped contracting my, well, stopped like in my mind contracting my glutes. I'm sure they were still contracting to some level, but uh, I was having some left erector pain, and then I started like really, really contracting my glutes hard as I got close to lockout, and my left erector pain went away, and my glute didn't have any pain, so that's a good sign. So uh, I think I can actually like, contract it and uh, with, with no pain, which is good. Um, MSI joint feels fine. Uh, that kind of sucked for a little bit that first day back, but... Um, yeah, overall, I have no complaints. I think the body feels good enough and uh, for, you know, having almost basically, basically three weeks off. I mean, yeah, and then going right into hypertrophy phase. I think I feel pretty good. So um, squats went really well this week, I thought. Um, hit some good baseline numbers to work on throughout the rest of the, the cycle. Uh, bench was really good. Um, like, yeah, bench like went really, really well, I thought. So, uh, and the tempo bench was crazy, man. Like, uh, it was like the first, I mean, I think the biggest thing that was so crazy was like, uh, I was just so tired after squatting and deadlifting that like, um, it was, it was hard, <laughs> but probably a lot harder than it will be in like a couple weeks when I'm finally kind of used to the volume. But, uh, yeah, my triceps were just fried after that first time, which was a really good feeling. I kind of liked that. So I bought, uh a bench block so it like attaches to the bar and it acts as a one board so and that seems to work really well um deadlift wise deadlifts just absolutely smoke them like i said uh i can like like purposefully contract my glute without any pain which is a very good thing because there for a while even when i came back i was not like contracting my glute um and uh, yeah, so that, that was good. The weights flew. They felt heavy, but um, they flew. So I feel like it had some pretty good baseline numbers at 450 for five, 480 for three, which, you know, uh, pretty, pretty light, pretty easy. So yeah, man. Um, I don't know. I don't really have too much else to say. Uh, yeah, body's feeling all right. I think we can continue to progress with what we're doing. And I'll let you know if. Uh, you know, the shoulder starts bugging me at all, or like the glute starts killing me or something, but um, I'm just going to continue to do what we're doing, and so we got a long way to late, G late January, so. All right, man, I'll talk to you later. All right, man, here's my training for the week. Um, start out squat here. Uh, this was 305 for six, an RP of seven, and it moved really well. So no, no complaints at all. Um, I moved 300 on my original week one. So I kind of wanted to add five pounds because 300 moved really well. So I figured I could throw 305 on the bar and be just fine. And uh, that turned out to be correct, which is awesome. Um, then moving on to bench. 
I believe this is like 220 for five, um, which is also super cool to be able to hit that. Oh, they move really well, other than just, I was just tired of the squats, so they might have been a little sloppier than I would like, but I thought the, the weight moved pretty well. Um, then we got deadlifts here, uh, I think it's my, yeah, my 450 for five, which again, it felt super heavy, um, but uh, it moved really well. As you can see, my lockouts are a little soft, and that was just because I was having that left or right pain, um, but once I started like really focusing on contracting my glutes, making sure my back wasn't taking any of the load towards lockout, my back was totally fine. And my glute held up, so no complaints there. Uh, then here's my 321 tempo bench, 205 for four, I believe is what this was. Um, yeah, these are brutal. These were brutal. I, I deadlifted first on this day, so I was kind of tired after that again. So these might be a little sloppier than I'd like, but still got the work in. And then we have another squat day. Uh, this was 335 for three. I remember I took the day off this day, it was on Friday, and I went in the morning, I was kind of tired, um, wasn't really feeling the best, but I still thought this weight moved pretty well, so I'm not going to complain too much. I thought bench went really well on this day, um, I think it was 230 for a triple, and I thought this moved really good. I'm starting way higher on bench than I did in my previous cycle, which is really uh, I mean, a good sign. So hoping for big things out of my bench this this training cycle. And then um, last day, 480 for a triple on deadlift. Um, this actually the weight itself felt better than the first day. So you know, it's gonna take me a little bit to get used to deadlifting again. But yeah, again thought that weight moved really well. It was here in the bar click though. Definitely need to focus on pulling the slack out. Before I pull. Uh, then yeah, 3-2-1 Temple Bench. This was easy. And uh, that's all I got, man. Talk to you soon.